Why do airlines let every passenger bring a carry-on when they know the bins won't fit them all? It's because the system works in their favor. I'm an aerospace engineer and carry-ons weren't much of an issue until 2008, when airlines introduced check bag fees and that shift flooded cabins with larger roller bags. The issue is, most aircraft still fly with low capacity bins that weren't designed for a full plane of carry-ons. A Boeing 737-800 holds about 160 people, but overhead bins typically fit only around 120 standard bags. Airlines have also increased sea counts without always expanding bin volume, shrinking per passenger storage space. Still, they allow every passenger a carry-on because it drives revenue. The shortage nudges passengers to check bags early, and bag fees brought in over $1.5 in a single quarter for US carriers. On top of that, airlines sell priority boarding and guarantee bin space to premium passengers, directly monetizing the problem. And even though they know the bins won't fit everyone's bag, they still keep the policy. It's the same logic as overbooking seats for no-shows. Assume not everyone brings a bag and roll the dice. Until airlines consistently retrofit fleets with larger bins and force stricter stowage limits or change the pricing model, someone's always going to hear, sorry, no more room.